Have you ever wondered what it would be like if the gods themselves walked among us? Imagine this, the sacred streets of Pashupatinath, alive with the echoes of devotion and mystical energy. Picture Lord Shiva, the destroyer and transformer, making his way through the crowd, his divine presence undeniable. Beside him, the beloved Lord Ganesha, the remover of obstacles, walks with the grace of an elephant, his small companion, the rat, scurrying close by. Hanuman, the mighty monkey god, known for his unwavering devotion and strength, strides with purpose, his eyes filled with wisdom. As they move through the streets, the atmosphere is electric. Devotees light candles, their flames flickering like tiny beacons of faith. The air is filled with the melodic chanting of mantras and the rhythmic beats of drums. The people around them are singing and dancing, their hearts overflowing with joy and reverence. It's a celebration of divine presence, a moment where the spiritual and the earthly realms intertwine. But the journey doesn't end here. Lord Shiva, with his trident in hand, leads the way towards the sacred crematory of Pashupatinath. Here, the veil between the living and the dead is thin, and the atmosphere is charged with a different kind of energy. In this mystical place, Shiva is met by devotees who are not of this world. Big devils, ghosts, and demons gather, drawn by his divine magnetism. They come to pay their respects, to seek his blessings, and to find solace in his presence. It's a reminder that Shiva is the lord of all realms, the one who transcends the boundaries between life and death, good and evil. This vision of gods walking among us, of divine beings mingling with mortals, is a testament to the power of faith and the mystical nature of Pashupatinath. It's a place where spirituality and reality merge and where the presence of the divine can be felt in every heartbeat, every breath. So, the next time you find yourself in the sacred grounds of Pashupatinath, Take a moment to close your eyes and feel the energy around you. Who knows? You might just sense the presence of the gods walking beside you. And in that moment, you'll realize that the divine is not a distant concept, but a living, breathing reality. Thank you for joining me on this mystical journey. Until next time, keep the faith alive and the divine close to your heart. Om Namah Shivaya.